All right, so how do you feel after the cross country? A bit shocked, really, to be honest. He was just awesome. So you expected it, didn't you? I wouldn't like to say too much, but touch wood, he's normally amazing cross country. Yeah, and you took the first place after the dressage test, so you had to expect it. <laughs> There's a lot of pressure and waiting around all day wasn't great for the nerves, but mm -hmm. he managed to keep occupied and pulled out the bag, so yeah. yeah. He's here a good jumper as well. Yeah. So, so, far, so, good. so probably you will be the leader still until the end. I'd like to think so, but anything yeah. can happen. So did you come here to Poland expecting that you will be the leader and not really? No, not at all. Oh. I'd like to have been in the top 10, but never mm. thought I'd be in the lead, to right. be honest. But yeah. So what do you think about the cross country? Yeah, I think it's tricky. I think everyone walks here thinking, yeah, it's not too bad, but there's a lot of places where it could have caught you out. All right, so how long have you been uh, competing on the international level? About a year, yeah. two years, yeah. And what is your plan after Stragom? Um, probably give him a holiday. I would have liked to have taken him to the western part to the two star, but right. I think he deserves a break to be honest. <laughs> of course. Yeah. Brilliant horse, really. Yeah. So, can you say something about him? Oh, he's just pure class. I don't think there will be another one like him. Where did you find him? Um, Libby Soli right. and James Adams rode him for them. Mm -hmm. But yeah, he's amazing to be honest. Congratulations and wish you good luck. Thank you very much. Thank you.